preliminary exercise, passing into a teammate's path. The focus of this practice is passing of well-timed balls into the teammate's path and the optimization of deceptive runs. Because the pressure by the opponent and of time and in tight spaces increases in top soccer, deceptive running to get open becomes ever more important. Yeah, take a break lads. A question. What can we do to keep up the pace after playing the ball to the player in the centre? so he doesn't have to slow down but maintain the tempo. Delay it slightly. And how do we do this? With a running fake. Change of direction, exactly. To adjust the coordination, let's come up with this kind of fake run to receive the ball without stopping. And let's move again. When faking a run, the deception comes from starting in the opposite direction. The player about to get open turns his early mental start into a spatial advantage by continuing in the initially intended direction after the fake. And now we'll play the pass into the run of the teammate. There is the attacker. And now the faked run, and here we go. Brilliant. The faked run only when necessary. Yes, the central pass exactly into the run. Keep the balls low, ground passes. Yusuf, you should have delayed your action a bit. Very good. Great. And that's just right too. Coaching points. Well-timed passes into the path of a teammate utilize fakes when running off the ball. Good coaching of all players.